What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl VGC video. Today, me and Brady will be building around this electrode. So Brady, you have any ideas? I know you, you just literally told me five seconds ago, I wanna build around electrode. Like, what do you wanna do with it? Um, Look, I've been thinking about electrode for a long time. Um, and what the benefits of like discharge spam? Cause I've been, I've been using a lot of like Zapdos, Garchomp, Disquake. Yeah. Dis Disquake stuff. Stuff. Um, yeah. <laughs> I need to not not use profanity for the for the YouTube. Watch your um, profanity. Um, but another thing that like I've sort of been thinking about is discharge plus lightning rod. Um, and the real problem with that is we don't really have any decent lightning rod users that like want the boost apart from like Raichu or maybe like a Pikachu but they're they're yeah. Raichu and Pikachu um I mean we could use special Petric. attack and Marowak for real <laughs> but um otherwise I I don't really know I feel like one of I think a good use of it is spamming discharge looks like a ground type or something obviously you can't you know do that with earthquake unless Use, I'm pretty sure this one gets magnet rise, right? It does. Um, do, yeah, you wanna hear, rise. do you want to hear my Sorry, epic idea that I just, that I just thought idea? of? All right, you ready? Yes. I'm screen sharing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Screech. Oh, true. Yeah. Wait, yeah, no, I think I forgot this one gets screech. I'm thinking it's, just it's, like full disruption. Like, I think Thunder Wave Screech would be nice, and we could... I mean, Sash is probably the best, but technically then, if we ran, like, moves like this, we could run, like, Wide Lens. Yeah, Wide Lens. Um, what ability would we want there? Because Soundproof is good for not getting hit by... Uh, Snarl. What do you call it? Snarls? Yeah. But, like, are you really looking to do damage with Electrode? Are you just are you just fishing for, for like, a little bit of chip... Plus, not uh, not particularly paralyzed. Yeah, not particularly, but not getting hit by snarl altogether is just probably nice, anyways. Because like, static is eh. We're already paralyzing everything. Um, yeah. And aftermath, and aftermath, it's you have to make contact, so it's like gonna be useless most of the time. So I think just soundproof overall gets us the best result. Is aftermath um work with explosion? Uh, is, no, is like because thing, but... it only works if you get KO'd by a contact move. Oh, uh, I see. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, I think also gets Taunt, which is something I've been looking at as well. It's like, uh, Taunt. Because I've been using, uh, the shiny, uh, Voltov that I got the other day as a, as like a catching Mons guy. Uh, yeah. I'll, I'll give it like Taunt, Thief. It's not a bad uh, idea charge stuff but like um screech and thunder wave definitely have like some decent like utility especially something next to something like a like a garchomp or like even what do you call it uh mammoth swine as well yeah um i'm thinking i really want to run garchomp right yeah no I, I i feel like on this sort of team you probably want to run the garchomp right yeah um, Wait, does that just get switch? Because otherwise, I'll feel really dumb. Okay, I don't it think it does. Good. All right. Okay. Yeah, guys, look, because this is niche now. <laughs> it gets screech. It can support the ground type, but also it's, you know, you gotta, yeah, you gotta like protect or use magnet rays or something. There's no air balloon in this game either. So yeah, uh, do we want to run protect or do we want to just like run volt switch? Because I think volt switch might be good for. Since we're outspeeding our own Garchomp, we could like Volt Switch the target and then Earthquake and go into something like a Levitate Mon or even just Togekiss. Yeah, Togekiss. Um, something else I've been looking into a lot is uh, God of War. God of War is like really good on teams like this. Yeah, with because like, you telepathy. can telepathy because you can discharge next to it. Um, generally you chuck like a scarf on that thing and you can lead stuff like Garchomp, God of War, and um, uh, you. Don't have to worry about a threat of like a lot of yours because you can just moon blast that slot and then do whatever with guard jump. Yeah, I suppose um, we can try that. Uh the only real problem is having to deal with stuff like um scissor because bullet punch just murders <laughs> murders God of War. True. Um which is the only real issue. Um 
Not which I suppose is Terry Kiss, which is probably like the one thing Terry Kiss can probably do is um actually eat the bullet punch. Eat the bullet punch if it's like holding like a Babiri berry or if it just EVs to live. Yeah, live it. I actually have that right here. Non life or bullet punch, we always tank with this thing. However, that said, Electrode in itself, I, I mean, its defenses aren't great, but it's still a resisted hit. You're still going to be doing like an all right amount of damage to a Sizzle. And yeah. we can always slap an Arcanine on the team as well. Yeah, I mean, like, we're probably going to want Arcanine anyways. Yeah, um, because that's one thing, because Electrode in this case um, is, let's say we're, we're building a core of, like, the Disquake core, which is Zapdos, Scarchomp, uh, God of War, right? Yeah. Um, By the way, I, I'm thinking we run Life Orb literally just because we can, like, do this to KO Latios, just literally Thunder Wave, Dragon Claw, and that's gone. Yeah yeah um it just like adds another sort of thing we can do against that thing yeah um earthquake protect another thing uh, yeah so it's covering for the zapdos in that in that situation um it's like still going to be able to take and tank some uh some hits with like the bullet punch yeah i forgot oh. i forget what my um i gotta what check. my point was i gotta check a speed tier real quick did you call her? Ooh, yeah. do we outspeed it? I think we do. So that's 244. And if we run timid. Ah, no. <laughs> no. Not quite. It'd be the, it'd be the psychopathic uh, Reggie Lucky player and run Scarf. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, no, we're not going to do that. <laughs> but I mean, we're not going to, but it's, it's pretty funny. We could. What do you think is a good uh, speed tier for this guy? I mean, he outspeeds everything in the game. Except honestly, for you, could, you could probably just, like, run it so it outspeeds, like... Because if you're going up against, like, a Crobat or an Aerodactyl... I, I, oh, Crobat specifically, I reckon. Yeah, it's just the only, like, it. thing that's, it's, like, kind of faster than it. Most of the time, oh, wait, they're, they not be, they're, gonna, they're not going to be... They're not going to be max-max. Uh, they're just going to, you know... <laughs> they're just... It is gonna be fast enough so it outspeeds like a Lottie or so like a Raikou or something. Yeah. But that's what I did on that's what I did on Microbat. Microbat set is um out, is to outspeed a Riker and be bulky and be able to live hits. Yeah, I think we should still hit 201 just to be safe, because I have seen a lot of like max speed ones. Max speed Crobats? Yeah, I have seen like a few of them. Yeah, I, I mean, I'd, I'd just be good in general. Yeah, um, um, we could try. This thing's got okay special defense. We could try to live like a Scald from Ludicolo. That's true. Yeah, so we like out, we are able to like discharge and then the Ludicolo is not going to be a problem. Oh, wait, no, that's really good because when, when if you go up against like a Ludicolo Pelipper, uh, you can go for something like a discharged uh, Rock Slide if you lead uh, like Electrode with Garchomp. Oh, we just tank that with max HP. Hey, really? Yeah, modest life where we tank it. Oh, that's insane. Yeah, so then we can always paralyze that thing. Yeah. Um, Thunder wave discharged. Oh, like bolt switch out. Yeah, let me see if we can take minus one earthquake from Garchomp. If that's at all possible. I, I think feel it, like... it might be. Because it's a spread move. All right, yeah. So it is does it, 107. It so. Uh, EV Minimizer survive with one. <laughs> Calculate EVs. Oh, wait, that's a thing? 12 HP, 204. Does no one know about this? I feel like I'm the only one who knows about it. No, I didn't know about that. I'm actually just going to put it in defense because we need that HP. It's the most efficient way to make use of our special defense. Okay, and like that, we live it. <laughs> Damn. Okay, so that's cool. So 252. I mean, that said, do we we don't really do anything to God Chomp, right? Yeah, but it's just nice to know we don't need the sash. Yeah. And then we can just I, get I the rest. So, yeah. We can just do that. Neat. That's actually that's kind of a nasty that's, set. That's that's kind of that's nasty. <laughs> pretty nice. I'm a big fan. Yeah, and then we, I mean, do we run protect? I I feel like we. Uh, uh, so you said Volt Switch, but um. I wouldn't be opposed to running like I mean pivoting is always nice, but that said, there's always the I'll we can always out. run taunt. Taunt is like super valuable. Like especially in the the matchup of like Cresselia or like Sizzle as well. So like Sizzle generally Like Sword Stance. 
Yeah, so like if you don't if you don't lead for like scissor, they'll know you play passive, so they'll just sword dance in front of you. So taunting is like super good. Oh, that's um, funny. We much? get guaranteed for it KO. That, that's pretty neat, actually. A big fan. How and we can always paralyze it. Um, item. Oh, wait, we don't care about the item. What am I thinking? I just need four. Well, yeah. So, I mean, Discharge doesn't do that. I think, I don't know. I think we kind of have to run Volt Switch just so it's not useless if we're like stuck next to Toekiss. Yeah, that makes sense, actually. That's that's mainly it, because we won't always have a Protect user next to it, and then like we're forced to just hard switch our Electrode or be useless. Mm. Yeah, no, it's fair. Screech to fall the wave. Uh, Godchomp. Where's my funny spread? Here it is. Well, in well, in that case, we could give up Trigger Kiss for um for God of War and then just like build a little bit better for for Sizzle. Um maybe i think we can have like other scissor checks i kind of really think toakis is going to be ideal in this situation mm. just because like at the very least we can take a bullet punch um, yeah and we there are definitely other ways we can deal with scissor in the format like we don't even have a water type yet yeah that's true i, I think we probably want a scissor on this team because i feel like a let Wait, no, that's how we do with Dragon Kiss. Because yeah. you need Electrode, you Screech, and then you X as well, and then you, uh, and then they perish. Yeah, because then we don't have to, like, because they're going to want to switch on the Bullet Punch, and then we can just take whatever comes in. Yeah. Uh, what about our last one? I think we still want the Water. The Water type? Yeah. Wait, I actually really like, like... You think Gyarados could be good? Gyarados could be good, but I'm also a big fan of Azur. Azur. Could be good. Because um, that's another mon we can screech with. Um, Turkish Azur has been like a thing for a little bit. Uh, we have enough for switch-ins for steel types and... Uh, not steel types. Uh, poison, Ross, Electric. We have like two switch-ins for each of those at least. Yeah, I'm down for that. Um, Azur could work. Um, uh, I mean, we could go Gara. Gara definitely is a, like isn't gonna be bad because it also gives us someone else to earthquake uh, next to. In fact, I think that's probably why we run Gyarados if we're going to. Yeah, it just gives us enough of Quake Mon to sit next to. What do you think of the spread? Um, is that just like grand? Oh uh, yeah, I, I love the the zero IV attack. Oh, that that know. was that was actually an, that was an error. Never mind. <laughs> okay, now it's done. Do you know what this does? Does it do? Look at that. Yeah. Look at that. I'd add speed. It yeah. adds speed. Because because we got to yeah, aqua jet okay. it. Yeah. I think, I I think like I don't know. It's it's really weird to say this but i think actually running this much speed on azu might be optimal optimal why he, yeah why is because that, then, attack keep then going to zero you're always um because then you're always out speeding it which is like really nice mm -hmm. so you're able to aqua jet it if it's if you need like a little bit of extra chip or it needs some more damage or if it like it's gonna be ko'd and you yeah. can just aqua jet it yeah, and I mean, like, uh, most scissor don't run that much speed, so just calcing for, like, the people who just dump the four speed in there. It's probably smart. Yeah. I think I like um, Azu more than Gyarados. Yeah, it's bad. I think I think Azu is just, like, really solid and yeah. isn't being used as much recently. Oh, yeah, by the way, uh, Electric also gets Eerie Impulse. Yeah, I noticed that. I just wasn't sure if I really wanted to run it because, like, we're kind of giving it too many rolls then. I feel like at that point it's just like bulky support mon that can discharge. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of, um, I kind of just want to click discharge or not discharge. I want to click like screech plus dragon claw into things. Hmm. Oh, actually, if we're not, we haven't used um sash yet, right? Uh, no, we haven't. Where would we throw that? I feel like we could probably get away with uh, sash chump and then life orb sizzle. Uh, but then we don't have a Lum anywhere. I think, That's true. I think Lum's a little too important. I feel like I haven't 
really Ooh, wait, wait, wait. needed Actually, Lumberry on my team. I've, I mean, I've been facing a lot of sleep, like so many Berloom for some reason. Yeah. Oh. Uh, I, I mean, I guess, yeah, but I feel like it, whenever I've... Uh, I it, it depends on the team I'm using as well. Oh, wait, no, because I'm because I'm using, uh, like, Scarf God for it. I just oh, yeah. erase that thing before I can do anything. Yeah, I mean, that I just sense. like having something to switch in on it. Because if you switch in on, like, a, on a Spore from Breloom, then you just KO it with, like, Bullet Punch. Yeah, true. I don't know, how does this look to you? Uh, I don't know, I feel like, it feels like it's missing something. I don't know what, but it's... I feel like it's missing some, a little, little something. I don't know. I don't know what. Or, I mean, it's got a decent um, defensive backbone. We got Kiss, Arcanine, Scizor. Uh, yeah. Azu eats hits pretty well. Azu is a good trick room check as well. Yeah. Um, I mean, you know, it was. It was. <laughs> it was. I mean, I mean to be honest, it, it, to be fair, it's like, what are you... What are you putting into Trick Room that really threatens Azur is my... Not much. Like, it's literally, like, I've seen Heatran, Cresselia, uh, Hariyama, and, like, none of those do anything to this thing. And then I Aqua Jet you. Yeah. <laughs> and it's just, it's about the same with, um, with, like, Scizor as well. I just bullet punch you and you perish. Yeah. Honestly, I think, I think this thing's ready to hit the ladder. I think we're ready to try it. I think it, I think it's looking pretty nice. Oh, one thing I will. Uh, so on this team specifically, do you want Scizor to outspeed? Uh, do you want your Azu to outspeed Scizor, or is it just um, it's only the two fifty two because you didn't have another set? Because I have a set, and it's um, actually en enough to outspeed Latios. Go ahead and throw that at in me. In Tailwind, yeah. I've put it in the wrong thing. I put it in the Route One podcast. Okay. <laughs> Here it is. That has, an, that has enough speed to outspeed Latios and Tailwind, or in this case, a paralyzed Latios. I think that's actually pretty heat. Yeah, no, I didn't I didn't want Azu to outspeed our Zoomer in particular, or our um our Scizor in particular, just other Scizors, so I like this. Uh yeah. so that was it. That means that we can literally just go Electrode X Scissor and like just annihilate Latios. Yeah. And then um, we always we always have like Azu as a switch in for like Arcanine. Luddier lead. Yeah. Okay. So it's okay. Really I, I, nice. I'm down. I'm down to hit the ladder at this. Let's see. It's, I'm already. Oh, that's the wrong team. That's the wrong, the wrong team. team. Muggers. Yeah. I mean, I'm already on an alt, so let's just do it. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, rain. Sure. Rain mode. Rain. Um. What do we do against rain? I think what I we mean, do I'll... is we can lead off Electrode Scizor. And that scares them enough where they feel like they have to fake out the scissor, and then we go for the, then we go for the thunder wave. Yeah, thunder wave into like a an X scissor, like yeah. next turn. Azu isn't bad in this matchup either, because um once we got rid of Ludi Caller, oh I guess they have Zapdos, but yeah. um dealing Which... dealing with Azu on their side is a lot harder than you would think. Actually, yeah. no. They got like bullet punch. They've got they've got like so many threats for hey, Azu. But you, but you know what goes first? Like you know what goes before the bullet punch though? Oh, awkward. Yeah. In the rain too. In the rain too. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like, I, I think Azu comes Azu, regardless. I think Azu is just like a really good switch in for like Arcanine because we were bringing Scizor. We need something so we ha can check the Arcanine. Yeah, it's just that last Pokemon that I don't know. Um, I like the looks of Garchomp, but. Uh, being Life Orb means that we are threatened against uh, the Rain Core in itself. Um, I mean, not if we get our our Thunder Wave off. That's true, actually. I think. Garchomp's but then, what do we do? What do we do back? Just like, I guess. I guess we just Dragon Claw it back. Yeah. Oh, yo. And we've led Discquake. All right. Uh, so we can Volt Switch on the Zapdos here, and we're Lum, so I kind of want a Swords Dance here. Yeah, so even if we do get paralyzed, my only my only fear is if they've gone for if they're just gonna go for earthquake uh discharge. True. Uh maybe we protect and just go chop. And volt switch in the Zapdos and then we threaten like rock slide. Yeah, I think that might be a good play. Um Protect Volt Switch. Yeah, so we all fast so it isn't like scoff chomp, which is something we gotta be afraid of. Phase earthquake. 
All right, that does a lot in this quick, and it's just going to be this quick, yeah. guys. And we can actually threaten the KO here if we win the speed tie with rocks or with uh, Dragon Claw plus Bullet Punch. Yeah. You want to do that, or do you think Rock Slide's a little bit better? Um. Well, I mean, Zapdos isn't doing anything to your Guard Chomp. Um. If you have a switch in for for the discharge, I guess we could probably go Electrode. But do you win the speed tie against Guard Chomp is the issue. Yeah, I mean, we kind of, I think we have to go for it, because if we go Electrode, we die to Earthquake. Yeah, but are they going to be going for uh, Earthquake or... They might be, I Dragon don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but... I mean, we can we can give up our Electrode, we don't, I mean, oh, do we want to do that, bro, just in case I have Rain in the back? I mean, if we give up, if we switch out our Scizor here, we earn nothing. And we might yeah. even just lose stuff, I think we just kind of have to do it try to try to dragon claw and and then go for like this bullet punch oh yeah just in case it's sashed yeah pretty much because also like i don't know could be they could just be bulky chomp i'm just i mean if if we win the speed tie you know you could you know could okay win. cool this isn't this isn't bad yeah it means right, that, check this out means check this not out. going for the earthquake wait for it boom there it we is we have speed and and now we and now <laughs> we have ludi caller potentially coming out. yeah and i'm really hoping uh, I think we can give up Garchomp here, and that lets us get Electrode in for free. Yeah, Ludicolo. Um, I feel like they fake out Scizor and probably Ice Beam with Polito. Yeah. Um, sir. I just want to get, like, yeah. I, yeah, we need to get Electrode in for free is the issue. Because if we get, because yeah. if we get faked out, then we die to the Scald. Actually, yeah, do we? Sir. Let, me, let me, let me run that real quick. If we're, if we're, if we're giving up our Garchomp um we could yeah we get KO'd oh wait that's before Sir. we dumped the rest so uh I mean we might but it's still not worth it I like I like giving up god jump trying to go for a dragon claw and then like protecting scissor yeah because then you block the fake out you block a potential skull from polyterrid and then if they faked out, oh, oh they just went for Hydro Bump. Yo, Dragon Claw oh, is that... gonna get a why does that do big so much damage? And we're just gonna get Ice Beamed, and yeah. now we have Electrode. And we could probably just Volt Switch on this thing, but I think it might tank it, so I'm a little concerned. Um, ninety nine percent accuracy. I never realized how accurate it gets. Uh, I mean, does we could discharge much? here and go Azu, and it doesn't really matter because we don't need Azu to win. I think Scizor is better. I or, feel may, like or maybe actually we just maybe think, we just stay in and take it. I think we volt switch onto the onto the Liddy Collar and then switch out our scissor for Azu that blocks. Yeah. Water move. Check this out. I mean, he has Hydro Pump. Oh yo. Giga Drain. Yo, he's Life Orb though. All right. Is is that? That's range? that's in that's in range of Bullet Punch plus Aqua Jet. We can just do both. I think. Yeah, the only real issue is Zapdos doing things. Yeah. Um, um, can we deal with Zapdos is my real question. Um, I mean, do you want to risk the bullet punch into Ludicolo and protect Azumarill? Uh, why not? Oh, wait, wait, Lumberry, aren't we? Yeah, we're Lum, so it depends. Ooh, okay. They might they might actually just Giga Drain our Azumarill and Thunder Scizor, and I think we have a chance to lift Thunder. Yeah, I think we probably X's her into into Ludi and then go for an Aqua Jet into Zapdos. Because in that way we're getting we're getting like a decent amount of ship on Zapdos, even enough that could be bullet punch range or even discharge range. Yeah. Cause we could we could also just like discharge the rest of the game away. That's true. Let's just go for it. Oh, they actually it's, let us hit this. Protect. Okay. Alright, we get staticked, but not the end of the world, because now I think we double the, the Ludi. Yeah, protect on Ludicolo is. It's it's where... actually really good because it's hard to fit on there. You have to give up either Ice Beam or Fake Out. So if Azumarill doesn't get fully paralyzed here, I think we win. Just because uh, of how specially yeah, yeah. bulky our our Electrode is. Yeah. All right. Oh, we actually just straight up KO. Okay, that would have made the last turn a little bit bad if we if we actually like <laughs> knew that because yeah. we would have made the play to hit it. <laughs> Yeah, well, no, that's, that's what I that's what I mean. I thought maybe that um, oh, they forfeit. Let's nice. go. I mean, we would have won anyways. Yeah, that's nice. pretty good. Yeah, I mean, Big Electrode. I, I Electrode feels like 
a, a very Gen 1 Pokemon, you know? But the fact that they max out its speed so much kind of gives it Regieleki Syndrome, where you don't even have to invest that much, and you get so much value out of putting things into other stats. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh... uh... Giving me a, it's giving this? me Reggie Alecky vibes, dude. Yeah, big Reggie Alecky vibes. <laughs> big, big, big Persona vibes uh, from from Electrode. Persona fans <laughs> when they see an Electro for the first time. Well, it's giving me Persona vibes. Reggie Alecky fans when they see your Electrode for the yeah. first time. <laughs> I think we still lead off Electrode here. It does so much. Oh uh, yeah, no Electrode is like really good here. I think we still go Electrode Chomp to be honest. Electrode Chomp, uh, with like. Scizor. Mm, Scizor. Scizor's good because it means we have like an ice type switch in. I think we do like the exact same team actually. Yeah, Azure seems really good into like uh like Metagross, I suppose. Yeah. Ooh. 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 So they're gonna is, they're nice. just gonna tailwind and they don't have ice punch in this gen. So no. we can go into Scizor and Actually I think we volt switch earthquake. We don't have a switch in, do we? You don't have it. We didn't bring anything. Yeah, we like, don't, but if we Volt Switch and Earthquake into this thing, it probably just drops. But we could also Volt Switch sure. this thing, and then we have a single target Earthquake, because this thing would have to be Sash to live. Yeah. I'll just Volt Switch uh, that. I, th I mean, Earthquake just demolishes Metagross regardless. True. Actually, you know, I'm going to discharge. I'm just going to discharge. Discharge Earthquake. Yeah, I don't, we don't need Honestly, we don't, we don't need Electrode. Honestly, yeah. Tailwind. Honestly, uh, that's also an option. Hello. All right, hey man, we have. Hey, we look, we got double priority. We didn't. We didn't. You know, we didn't uh, lose the the game plan. Okay, and these that's a, things. That's a, that's a Shumagorath. What the fuck? Yeah, these things always run flamethrower, so I'm just gonna play rough and yeah. protect. Ooh. Red. Red. Uh, I mean. We can still double it. We have a chance to win because I feel like they didn't bring Ludi in this game if they brought freaking this. Yeah, no, but that, I feel like that's just it. I'm gonna bullet punch Why play rough because that just guarantees we get some damage off with Scizor. Yeah, I always forget this guy gets flamethrower. Yeah, it's just Pelly. Oh, he actually might save us then if he flamethrowered. You water spot it. Okay, and right, we still got the damage off. That KOs. Um. And we're also Citrus Berry, so I think we can just hammer away at this guy. Yeah. Because then we just have you to know. Aqua Jet that guy in the end. Hopefully we oh, take yeah, the Hurricane. And, um, and like Foul Play is not doing anything because it, because Huge Power doesn't affect oh, that. Oh, we got crit. We got crit there. Well. And uh, that may have mattered. That might have mattered. Uh, it depends, because I think the Hurricane would have sent us into Citrus. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Uh, uh, Oh, that was weird. That was a weird game. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you want to um, go... I think we definitely need to Azu this game. Azu looks kind of nice, actually. Because yeah. Because you have... You have got, like... I think every, everything on this team doesn't like Azu, except for maybe Sizzle. Yeah. Uh, and, um, you know, this guy. <laughs> this guy. I mean, you, you can play rough that guy. I mean, you're slower, but you can do that. Yeah. Uh, Arcanine's also really good in this matchup. Yeah, because you just get get intimidated on everything. In fact, yeah, no, right. Arcanine's just really good because you can snarl, uh, you can snarl Heatran. You get intimidated on everything else. Do you want lead uh, arc? I think Arcanine, uh, psh, Arcanine, Arcanine electric. Sizzle does Electrid. Uh, yeah, Electrid could work. Um, Azu for sure. Azu and I feel like you need God Chomp this matchup. Let's do it. Oh, actually, no, you got no, oh. you got uh, you got. Uh, Nah, I was going to say we have Azure. We trust have Azure. Me, this is exactly what we want. Check this out. He's going to give us the world's freest Thunder Wave on that Scizor. That Ciz oh, I mean, that Scizor is going to be doing absolutely not. Probably going into... What? Into Heatran or Garchomp, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, wait. Do you want to see a gamer like, that's play? A, that's like a guarantee. Like, almost just this, like... This is going to be my gamer play. I'll screech into it. You're... Dude. Okay. No. That's oh, fine. But... That's actually still fine. Cause now he knows. <laughs> okay, he he knows. He knows I mean, and he now must fear. He doesn't, he doesn't know about he doesn't know about Screech there. Yeah, I'm gonna T wave. Um no, we already showed Screech. Oh no, we got flinched. I'm stupid. You got flinched. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Uh, uh, so I think I'm gonna take think... Go arc. Well, you could also volt switch back out into Azur. Like you can, uh, you can. Oh, you're Switch right. out into uh, volt switch into. No, I uh, I, I agree. Go? Yeah, like volt switch into Scizor, go hard arc, and then get Azu back in. Yeah, and then there are minus two Scizor if they don't switch out, and then we can. Oh, oh heat we're that's gaming. Heat. We're gaming. Well, that's that's what we call heat, brother. I dare you to SD. SD, bro. Go ahead. Ooh. See what happens. See what happens. All right. <laughs> mess around. You ready? See. Ready? Here's where we. Here's where we actually belly drum in his face. Yeah. He doesn't. He doesn't do anything to us. Oh, yep. He's gonna F power, right? Doesn't even matter. Flash cannon. Flash you cannon? see, he's gonna think he wins the speed tie. Oh yeah, sure. He's, true, gonna, true, he's true. gonna think he wins here, but guess what? He does not. And I, I bet you, I bet you, we can just snarl here. And then we, we get something for free here, basically. Like, nothing switches in for Scizor, so we can get rid of whatever comes in. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Oh, because we got we have Arcanine. We have... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom! <laughs> I told you that's... <laughs> I told you that speed would pay off in this video. I told you. That's insane. Yeah, okay. All right. Uh, now, now you Snarl Protect, right? And let's yeah. go... Oh, do you, I Snarl Protect... Uh, it could... You know, I'm gonna call it having faint. You you literally can't run anything, and it doesn't. You can't run anything but faint on this guy. It's like optimal. So I'm gonna snarl, and I'm just gonna go for an aqua jet. We don't lose if we lose this thing, like, cause everything else in the back dies to like, Garchomp. Yeah. Unless it got wide guard. No. Yeah, yeah that's, that's fine. A, that's a... All right. Here's our play. It's it's definitely has wide guard. So I'm gonna flare blitz and I'm gonna screech. Oh yeah, base. If we hit, if we land the screech, the sent on top's dead. Yeah, there it is. Screech. Oh, we missed. Hello. H how accurate is it with the wide lens? Hold on. Wait. What is? What do we uh, do? I'm, I'm gonna. I mean, we still do it because this thing has no defense. It's 93. percent I hate this game. <laughs> do it again. Yeah, we do, do it, it again. again. We do it again. You don't. You don't run protect on hit on top. There we go. All right. There you're gone. Go. Out of here. Boosh. Boosh. He's gone. Boosh. And there's the chomp. chomp. Um, this comes down to oh, we have to land a screech in the chomp if we have to win if we want to win, and then we have to land an EQ. Because Heatran dies to EQ, and at minus two, Garchomp should also die. Should at least a life all one, yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna screech here. Oh. Okay. All right. We have a chance okay. to win, but it comes down to winning the speed tie. And if, it's, and if, if it's it Scarf Chomp, Claw. and if it's Scarf Chomp, we win anyways. Cross your fingers, Brady. I'm crossing them. Cross your toes. I'm knocking. I'm knocking on wood. You did Yo, hear all right. It. You know what? <laughs> yeah. You know what? You know what? Shuka. Shuka yeah. doesn't matter. Okay, maybe it does, but we still can win this. Knock on wood. It's not Scarf Chomp. Actually, how much did the Flash Cannon do? Thirty-four. Does that KO at minus one? Does it? I'm just gonna earthquake. I think we kind of have to. We got here. All Come right. Come on. Oh, we didn't lose. This thing's dead. This thing's dead. Yes. <laughs> oh, oh. Let's go. Dragon Claw to assert dominance. GG. GG. <laughs> oh let's go, my god. Dude. Yo, Electrode's actually kind of hype. Electrode hyping it up, dude. We this... got the the screech on deck. Yeah. Let's do For... one more. Let's do one more. Yeah, I'm down. Bro, I'm, I'm gonna be using my shiny, my shiny Voltorb to this, be a shiny this, Electroid. This set's kind of nasty. Kind of awesome. Hey man, I did a little uh, yup. Yo. And, uh, it, it's some cloning of that guy if you want one. Perhaps. Just saying. Yo, Perhaps. we can we can prevent Tailwind outright. Yes, we can. Because we can Yo. Volt Switch and then go for BP. Yes. Okay. Cool. Yeah. No. I'm. I'm. A, I'm a fan. Yeah. Garchomp. Okay. Uh, do we, uh, we bring Garchomp and Azure? Do we bring Turkey? I think Azu's better. Azu's better. Yeah. Azu better. See, is, you know, Togi fell off. I'm, dude, this is what I've been saying, dude. We haven't brought Azure. We haven't brought Turkey a single time. I feel like that happens Surely a lot in this format. Like, it's, it, most most teams in this format are four Pokemon teams. It yeah, feels like. I can, 
I feel like whenever I build a team that has uh, Turkey Kiss on it, it's like I never bring it. So do I just bring another Mon? Is the question? Is what I'm. We're what about I'm feeling. To, we're about to end this man's whole career. We're about to go ham. This might not KO. We're four special attack investment. <laughs> but we get Azu in, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Bro, KO. Come on, KO. Come yes! on. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Azu for free. Pathetic. Nice tailwind loser. <laughs> you saw it. Right on watch. Good one. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna protect here. I'm gonna protect here, right? And I'm gonna X scissor this Rotom Wash because I wanna get Electrode in. Yeah, oh, yeah, true. I feel like our problem on this team is not being able to be faster than other Yo. Yo, this is huge. Yo. Yo. I'm gonna double it. <laughs> I'm gonna double it. Well, you might be saying, oh, don't we lose to Earthquake then? Don't we lose to Earthquake? Yes. <laughs> We do. We, we literally do. do. Uh, we might live this EQ with our Azu. How much did it do before? It was... Oh, yeah, no, I think uh, it's... I'll run the cow. We only... It, it depends on the... um, Like, for, for what it did before, it, like, it will KO, but that might it might have been, like, a... A high roll. High roll, yeah. High roll warriors, my favorite Dude, video I said game. It. Save custom set. Come on, how much time do we have? 120 seconds? Easy. Ben. Azumarill. My custom set. Garchomp. Uh, Picolytic set. Jolly Life Orb. Earthquake. Plus two. All right. We die. Yes. <laughs> um, yeah, we die. <laughs> we yeah, perish. Uh, we have to Aqua Jet here in case it's Sash. And then we have to win a speed tie. So I think what we do here is... Actually, we could protect. And then bullet punch. Oh, no, we protected last turn. So we Aqua Jet at this turn and we protect our Scizor. Yeah, we want to keep the Scizor around. And a... Okay, uh, that's fine. Okay. Uh, do you think we just double it now? The Garchomp? Uh, yeah. Just, just for damage. Yeah, because I feel like we're gonna protect Entei Earthquake. Yeah, yeah. That's and right. if we get a crit, if we get, I said if we get a uh, crit, I, if we get a crit, okay. okay. <laughs> All right, if we win the speed tie, <laughs> we win um, the speed tie. All right, so check this out. <laughs> so check this out. I'm not gonna Earthquake this turn. Okay, well, yeah. No, I'm gonna Dragon Claw. I, I would... Dragon and Claw. And I'm gonna Thunder Wave there. And I could Discharge as well, and that catches Rotom. That's that's true, actually. Yeah. I'm gonna Thunder Wave. Or Discharge, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, Speed Tie, Speed Tie, Speed Tie. How many times is the Speed Tie gonna come into play in this video? Hey, man, we're, we're running Electrode. Surely we get that, like, that little bit of a... Yeah, Electrode's ability. Ele Electrode's passive is giving you this uh, this damage output. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now we hit him with the Screech Dragon Claw, and he won't know what hit him. He doesn't. He won't know, dude. He, he doesn't know what's up. He has no concept of the damage he's about to take. <laughs> what's the likelihood he protects this turn? What's the likelihood he scarf actually? <laughs> that would suck. That uh, would actually, cool. no. We can actually check real quick. Oh, didn't um, I, it didn't protect? No, it didn't. Uh, here. So, it went for a Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt went before the Swords Dance. It's Scarf. Oh, oh no. We still do this. It Is can it, miss Hydro Pump. Yeah. It can, it can do that. Yeah, it protects. Okay. Okay, well, we perished. Um, we, there's okay, still an so out. There's still an out if we discharge. Yeah, so we paralyze Entei every turn, and then we he missed. Rotom. Yo, I he think missed? We, I think we paralyzed it, or we're just the bulkiest electrode ever made. All right, he's probably got extreme Miss speed. Miss again. He's got extreme speed. Okay, even if he does extreme speed, does that care? All right, he can next. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't doesn't need to. <laughs> Something deep in yeah. my soul said he's scarf, and I had to double check. <laughs> yeah, I mean, still, this team's hype as hell. 
This this team is very hype. Electrode going kind of ham. We've got two. We've got two round blue things. I mean, it's it's blue because it's shiny, but it can be red. It yeah. Can be red but yeah um, um I, I think we can just wrap it up there i think this team's pretty solid yeah no i'm a i'm a big fan i'll probably end up using this for a for a video yeah um i don't know when you're gonna release this but i can probably organize to put it at the same time unless you're doing it like tomorrow uh it's probably <laughs> going to be uploaded after christmas like the 27th i have to check i'm scheduling all my videos right now but yeah if you guys enjoyed leave a like subscribe to the channel check out brady of course link in the description as always and uh i will see you guys in the next one bye